Hey guys, here from my parents' house. Uh, I have uh, my little sicky here. Say hi. Hey. Poor baby. So I have officially, it is August 24th, and it is less than a month till my consultation. <laughs> I am in the process of just kind of telling everyone in my family still that this is something that I'm doing. And I want to let speak it. I just, I just want to like speak it into existence. I, I want to say that it's happening, that this is a choice that I have made, and I will keep on continuing to follow through with it. And uh, if this is, this is gonna happen. So the more people I tell, I, I, I own everything that has led up to this. So everything, you know, that's here on me, I, you know, just, uh, I'm gonna own it, you know, this, I got myself here, and I'm, I'm gonna get myself back out, just working my way through, I have a big family, <laughs> I have four brothers, four sisters, everyone's married, um, all but two of my siblings have at least one kid, <coughs> and, no, I think everyone has two, except for two of my siblings, so it's, there's a lot. My, my parents just had their 14th grandkid, just to give you an idea. So there's a lot of talking, and so a lot of people to tell, but it's a lot of accountability. So I fully expect myself to be held accountable, not just them, but to me, through everyone that knows, hold up, be held accountable. Um... <coughs> I went to I went to this splash pad with Lydia here. We got there and this is my my best friend of all time. It was her daughter's fourth birthday and everybody is thinking that it's gonna rain and so things are just like boom 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 boom. Like she's trying to get everybody fed and do the cake and say happy birthday and like get all the presents in the car and everyone thought it was gonna downpour. It never rained. So <laughs> I mean I just like realized in that moment that I was I mean there was pizza there and I just like could not help myself. I I was so stressed. <laughs> thinking about the fact that I was in a bathing suit in a public place and I could possibly have to get out and get in the water. I never had to, but that was stressing me out and I ate that and I, I ate cake and I wanted to eat Lydia's and I was like, no, you you need to eat your piece of cake. Like, what is going on with me? Um, yeah, so... Dress. So I'm there. There's my. I was in my best friend's wedding, so I know her family, and I've been around them for a while. And but I haven't seen everybody in I don't know, probably a year or so. And I got there, and I just haven't been wearing a lot of makeup recently, so I was just like this. And I mean, I know I've probably gained like 40 pounds since they last saw me, at least. Uh, and I'm sure it's like all right here. I don't, I don't know. But I saw her aunt, and I, you know, waved, and she looked at me and acknowledged me, and then didn't even notice me, like notice that it was me until later. And my my first thought was, wow, she didn't even recognize me. You know, like she didn't even did she not recognize me because. I'm bigger or because I didn't have makeup on or like what was the reason my immediate reaction in my head was it's because I gained so much weight she didn't even recognize me so I have to I have to work on that because I, I can't go into a surgery with those types of thoughts so what I'm gonna start doing is getting some I'm gonna start going to counseling beforehand I really am because I mean, YouTube is not is not counseling. I think that it's good that I talk about it, and that other people realize that it, that they're not the only ones that think those types of things. 
And then tonight, my little sister was showing videos of, of her going to Six Flags and riding on rides and going to Disney World and riding those rides. And I'm like, I don't even want to go. I don't want to go because I can't do that. I can't do that stuff. And I, I just can't live the rest of my life like that when I have her. And I know she wants to do that stuff. She sees her cousins doing it. That's where I'm at mentally. I will check back later. I'm gonna keep doing a few <laughs> videos of things that like, the situation, like real life, real time, of things that, that just happen to people. I mean, we just know, we know we're too big to do things, so we just don't do things. You know, we just kind of like squeeze our way out of doing things just so that we don't have to get caught in a situation where we, we know we're trying to do something we know we can't. You know, if we drop something on the floor and we know that we can't bend over and reach it, we're just going to leave it there until we can get up and like maneuver in such a way to pick it up. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I know you do. Anyways, that's all I got for you tonight. Check back later. Bye.